Hey guys, welcome back. By the time you probably see this, I'll probably be at home anyway because I go home tomorrow. As you may or may not know, the signal and Wi-Fi around here is absolutely crap. That's one thing I'm not going to miss about this place because the I've been struggling with trying to upload videos all week. I've only managed to upload one out of about four or five. So... <laughs> Not quite like Cornwall last year where I had awesome Wi-Fi. So I'm going to give you a little tour where I'm staying. So here so we go. we're staying in the market town of Framlingham in Suffolk. It's quite a, a cute place, fairly small uh, little town. It is also the home of Ed Sheeran, which is a pretty cool fact. Um, because if I saw Ed Sheeran, I'd be proper fangirling right now. However, um, they, they talk about, the, the people who live here talk about it as though it's the norm just to see Ed Sheeran walking into the pub. And to be honest, it's, I think if I saw Ed Sheeran walk into my local pub or Indian, I'd just be like, what? Apparently he's often seen buying stuff in the co-op and I'm just like, why is he on tour this so week? this is the house that we are staying in. And it is a gorgeous property. This is the garden. I mean, the only thing I will say is I'm not used to having not much of a garden. Don't get me wrong. It's, I mean, it's all right for the property size because I mean, the property size is huge. Doesn't need a huge garden, but I do like a garden with a bit of grass. This is right out the front, so you hear a lot of road noise. Jamie's brought the swing ball along. So there's like a game of swing ball, anybody? So we've got quite a few doors to the front of this property and around the rear and the side. Um, awesome. The neighbours are very noisy though, they're very annoying. Uh, the garage is awesome. So we've got a barbecue under here. Some sun loungers which I didn't realise we got and some... What's in here? You know, I'm one of those curious people that has to see. No, it doesn't even open anyway. Anyway, let's go up here. This is probably the coolest room in the whole place. Because up here, guys, we have a games room. Complete with table tennis, table football, and a pool table, which is very rickety. This room is probably my favorite because it's quite a novelty to have a games room. And oh my God, what the hell is that? monstrosity up there there are some deadly spiders up here guys i'm telling you now and there's even a net so if the table tennis ball flings over here you've got a net to catch it down the stairs we go back down here so through here we've got a little laundry room we've added cobwebs and spiders but yeah, it's well equipped. Then in here, we've got another toilet, which I don't like to use because it's got massive dummy long legs in there. It reminds me a bit of the outside toilet we used to have in the Isle of Wight. And then this is the outside fridges, which we've been using as our fridges. Because why not? It's even a picnic basket. <laughs> and then in here, I haven't actually checked out in here. I don't know what's in here. Yeah, it's locked. That's this a shame. Is the kitchen. It's very nice. Cool kitchen. Got everything you need. Even got a little TV. Then through here, I've got the lounge with an added Eden project. Got in here the snug, which is our other lounge. Yo, yo, yo. I'm not sure about this today. I think we'll be able to take it out now. There we go. And there's another toilet in there, which I will show you in a minute. Um, it's being used at the moment. Then we've got the stairs here. Up the stairs, up the stairs, up the merry stairs. This property is nice, but I, it's hard to beat last year's, I still think. I do 
come will hold some many memories for me. Right, so we're at the top of the stairs. I'm not sure which room to start with first. I think that one's in use and that one might be in use. So we'll go in here. This is my Auntie Sue's room. It's very nice. Not a lot to it, but it's nice. Then if we go this way. We've got mum and dad's bedroom. We're in bed. TV. And then ensuite bathroom. Very nice. And a door. Ooh, oh, that's a bit boring. And my face again. Up the stairs to mine and Eden's room. Mine and Eden's bedroom. It's this beautiful one here. As you can see, it's not the tidiest of rooms, but <laughs> this, this is our room. And it's so nice just to be able to put your foot out the window and just like <laughs> get a nice tan on your leg. <laughs> then, if we come out of there, oh, is someone seriously in the shower? I'm trying to do my house tour and there's people like in every room. Okay, so this is the other bathroom that we have. Really good. It's, it's a nice bathroom, right? Like. We've got a nice picture of Framlingham Castle on the wall. Okay, so finally I can show you the other nice room, which is the shower. <sighs> so cool in here. We've got a beautiful shower. Nice bog, a bee day, and a mirror. And then this is my brother and Joe's room. Okay, and this. <laughs> That's like a bomb's it. Yeah, this is uh, Jamie and Joe's bedroom. Very nice. Not a big room, though. Right, I shall shut the door. Cheers. Okay. So that is the house tour done. Let's get to Framlingham. Where are we? We're in Framlingham. Where are we? Framlingham. Oh, this is the little milkshake place. Ice cream, rum, raisins. Oh, ginger sorbet, that sounds interesting. There's Riverside Garage, where Ed Sheeran's family get their tyres done. And also where Eden got his tyres done. <laughs> For 20 quid. So this is the charity shop that Ed Sheeran donated a massive Lego head to. And there. Ed Sheeran, mate. I just bought an Ed Sheeran, well, a, jewel, a piece of jewelry uh, Ed Sheeran's mum, not my mum, created and made. And it is Castle on the Hill bracelet. <laughs> Castle on the Hill on it. Yes. £35 well spent and plus some earrings so £36 actually yeah I'm really happy with it and also um, in that shop there was a huge head that Ed Sheeran had made himself which we found out today because he made it when he was bored on tour but made out of Lego I'll put the picture somewhere around here see the selfie we had with it and it's been in the papers recently that he donated it to the charity shop here yeah it's cool so cool. We met Ed Sheeran just in Lego form, didn't we? <laughs> <laughs> the ginger Lego version. 